welcome back to Reading with Leanne. We are going to read the book, Worm Weather. I know sunny weather and rainy weather. What exactly is worm weather? This is by Jean Taft and it's illustrated by Matt Hunt. Let's, let's open this book and read. On the cover, we see two friends, or maybe they're siblings, that's a brother and a sister, playing in the rain, and there's worms coming up. Hmm, worm weather. So, it looks like it's a normal day, but then out of the sky comes drip, drop, skip, hop. It rains more, splish, splash. Sidewalk dash! When it's just a few drips, you're skipping. And when it's a splashing in the rain, you start to run, right? You don't want to get caught up in the rain. All the footsteps are moving quickly above and below the ground. Worm, worm, wiggle, squirm. Worm weather. So this is what worm weather is. When it gets really, really wet outside, the worms surface right to the top of the ground. So what do you need for worm weather? Coat, hat, rain, go splat. So at the window, right on the window pane, you can hear the rain hitting it. So I think these are siblings and they're going out with their mother. It looks like a little brother and an older sister. Boots, jump! Old tree stump. So the boy, he goes on the tree stump and jumps down. And the worms are still squirming below. Big stomp. Puddle swamp. See the swamp with lily pads? The frog sees the girl and jumps away. Mud, stop! The boy goes belly flop! Almost. So the mom grabs him just in time so he doesn't land in the mud with all the worms. But it's raining harder now. Dark cloud. Very loud. Bright flash. Thunder crash. So it gets darker and darker. The rain is raining harder. The worms are squirming. And the two siblings, they hold hands and run. Quick race. Pizza place. So they run inside to get dry. <gasps> Drip dry. Pizza pie. So they're sitting in the booth. Oh, their coats, their hats, everything must be soaked. But they get to dry off. Drink a drink and bite into something warm and crunchy and cheesy. Their hands must be cold, right? Their hands must be maybe wrinkly from the rain. And then they look outside the pizza shop. Sun pops, drizzles. No more rain anymore. <gasps> Birds fly. Trip, 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 trip. Rainbow sky. So in the beginning of the book, you saw a pet owner holding its dog. It didn't want the dog to get wet. But now it's getting dry. We see an older lady walking her wiener dog, her dash hunt. And the rainbow comes out. Because when there's rain and when there's sun together, a rainbow appears. Run, sing, 
playground swing. So now they're on a playground. <gasps> and it looks like a pirate playground. Whee! Somebody just came down the red slide. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Somebody's going to come down the blue slide. Whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. The girl is on the swing. There's a boy at the top. He's going to look through his telescope. Hmm. Worm, worm, wiggle, squirm. And now the rain is gone. So what do the worms do? They might wiggle back home, right? Wiggle, 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 wiggle. They might go back into the ground. It's worm weather. So the siblings, the boy and the girl, they lie down in the grass. And you see the little worms around them. Thank you so much for reading along with me, reading about this rainy day that turned into a sunny day, um, even there was a rainbow. So this was by Jean Taft and it was illustrated by Matt Hunt. Worm Weather. Thanks guys!